Seems the Samu strike in Tswane is far from over. Municipal workers affiliated to the union say they won't stop disrupting services until they're paid in full. While the mayhem continues, the city says it's financially stretched and cannot afford to pay more. It's dismissed more than 90 of the striking workers. Our reporter, Puli Lesuiti Jones, spent the day with workers in the capital. The municipal workers are striking over a promised 3.5 salary adjustment for the year 2021 and 2022. And now 5.4% from July this year. The metro, however, says there's simply no money to pay the salary adjustment. But the municipality workers say that's rubbish. No, we are going to stay here. And we are going to stay here. arrogant <laughs> And uh, 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 there must be intervention of the province. Provincial legislature must convene their own special uh, 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 <coughs> provincial meetings to, 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 to discuss about reg regional challenges because this city of Tuani is not an institution alone. We are not in another province. We are in the province of Gaute. The city of Tuani says although it doesn't have money, it's trying to seek other avenues of paying workers. So we said to Treasury, guide us on the process. Here is an approach from the unions saying, can we reconsider our position? In terms of the FMA, MFMA, you cannot tinker with the budget, uh, but we can look at other uh, mechanisms internally to try to fund the increase. The Metro says it hopes to reach an agreement with unions, including SAMU, on Tuesday when the next negotiations meeting takes place. Pule, Lichwiti Jones, Antoine.